Hello and welcome to this travel vlog. Guess where we're at? Maybe you recognize the surroundings. Menes and I took the train to my mom's place yesterday, which went fine. I had this huge suitcase, Menes. Menes's little cage thing and my big backpack. So it was uh, a hassle, but we made it here and now we are packing up and sorting all of our packing because we're heading to Stockholm this afternoon and then from Stockholm we're taking the night train to northern Norway. Woo woo! It's Menes's first time abroad and Yesterday was his first time on a train, but there was there were no issues with that. He's fine and hopefully he'll be fine tonight as well. We'll see. I'm going to have to take him out and pee and poo and stuff when the train stops. So that's going to be interesting. But I thought I would bring you guys along. Hello? 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 How is your packing going? Excellent. I have this huge suitcase. Don't look at my underwear. <laughs> um, so I think I'll be doing just fine. I have dog food and a dog uh, cooler mat. Mm -hmm. I think I'll be fine. Mm -hmm. If I didn't have Menis along, I would easily fit all my stuff into just the suitcase and I would probably have space to spare. But uh, Menis requires a lot of stuff. Stockholm now at the central station waiting for elevators but there are other dogs that also need to take the elevators so one dog at a time menace can wait <laughs> we found ourselves a bench on a track that is not being used Train. Oh my Service god stop talking with departure time 16:51 as I was saying, for the hundredth time, um, we have uh, put our, all our stuff down around this uh, bench here now. So my mom went to get some coffee, some fika. Uh, so we'll sit here. The train leaves in... Uh, it's now quarter to five and the train we're taking to Norway leaves 20 past six. So one and a half hours approximately. And we're having dinner on the train. Menes has been doing a great job so far. He has been kind of snoozing, kind of chilling on the trains. He, on the trains, he sits in this usually. We don't shut it, obviously, because it's a bit too small for him, but it's perfect when he's just sitting in there and has his head and the upper body out the roof of the uh, cage. But this, uh, the challenge of this journey begins on the next train because of the short stops. Um, there are five minute stops every now and then along the journey and the longest stop of 20 minutes is tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. So I'm gonna have to go out with Menace uh, then and set my alarm clock and everything so I don't miss it and just make sure he gets to pee and poo if he needs to. I'll keep you guys updated because I know some of you are interested in uh, taking long train rides with your dogs and I thought why not document how this goes and <laughs> share my experience with all of you.
what do we have to eat here? Smoked ham and cheese salad and a prosciutto and mozzarella salad. Bread. Valpolicella rispasso and paper cups. Norwegian well water. Apple. We have an egg. Some kind of special peanut butter. This one is ecological peanut butter. It's crunchy with sea salt. Not for you. And my niece. Hello. What do you have? What did you bring? <laughs> Nothing. We're all set for this journey. <laughs> what happened here? Well, I don't know. <laughs> Somebody's had too much to drink, I think. <laughs> It must be menace. Menace. Too much red wine. But at least it was Valpolicella Rispasso. Yeah! Good morning. I think we just stopped in Gällivare and the Mendes uh, jumped out to pee. I have not slept. I've slept maybe an hour in total tonight. I don't know why. It's just like this bed is like 80 centimeters wide <laughs> and having a Mendes sleeping on me and not being able to move or change positions or whatever, it's just not comfortable and it's been cold and... I mean, Menace has slept great! <laughs> he has been snoozing all night, huh? You've been snoozing all night. Oh, you've been snoozing so good. Oh, it's so comfy you've been, huh? He's been having a good time. Um, I... I haven't brought the camera out when we go pee because I'm so like, oh, I need to get him to pee and then we need to get back on the train so we don't miss the train. Uh, it hasn't been close that we miss it or anything because I just take him out to the closest pole, he pees on it and we go back in. What else? Not much else for now. My mom is uh, getting coffee, we have some bread for breakfast and whatever. And uh, it's about 8, 8.30ish now. And we arrive at 1 p.m. And Amenis, how you doing? Are you having a good time traveling by train? No. No, no good time traveling by train, Amenis says. How you doing traveling by train? <laughs> it's uh, like for us two and Menes, who is a small dog, this is fine, this area. Uh, obviously the bed space is kind of cramped, but there's not a lot of floor space. So if you have a lot of packing and you have a big dog who should be sleeping on the floor, I mean, honestly, all dogs should be sleeping on the floor, but uh, then it might be a little bit more difficult, I guess, unless you want the big dog sleeping with you, which will probably make sleeping even more difficult than it was for me. Um, but uh, you can also like flip up, like the, the backrest there, that's a bed, and then there's a bed up there, and the same goes for this side. So you could always uh, flip up one of those middle sections and, I don't know, get more space.
Tack för att du har hej. Och så vidare. Och så vänder tills förstöjning av länder. Hello. Uh, we have about one hour left. A little bit less maybe. A little bit more. I don't know. But one hour to go. Uh, Menes is uh, ready to poo. <laughs> <laughs> but there are no longer stops left. Okay, I will wait. Yay! Um, but uh, in general, this uh, trip has been smooth and it's gone well with Menis. He's been a very good boy. Mostly just snoozing and chilling. He had some breakfast before, which was good. Right, buddy? It's gone well for you. We're almost in Norway. We're passing the line between Sweden and Norway soon, I think. If we haven't already, I don't think so. And I really need to go to the bathroom. But we're we're almost there. Ooh, almost in Norway. Ooh, ooh. Okay. <laughs> See you later. finally here and I'm super sweaty and Menace is exhausted. So as I mentioned before we're here now. It's a little bit windy so I'm gonna make this short. Uh, that's all for this video because it was the journey that was the video and now we have finished the journey. We have arrived at our destination and I'm out with Menace now so he can pee and poo a little more. But I'll definitely vlog again at some point during this week we're here. But I, I'm not doing it every day. So we'll see when the next vlog shows up. Thanks for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. Until next time, have a super duper good one. See you later. Goodbye.